network attached storage solutions powered by Windows Storage Server, affordable, easy to use cloud ready storage, the ideal solution if you are starting or running a small business and need to take the angst out of having your first server. Join us as we walk you through a few basic steps to get you up and running with a special focus on extending your server into the cloud from anywhere access to Azure Backup and Office 365. Your first steps may vary as some storage server 2012 R2 Essentials models may ship with pre-configured hard drives, while others may be offered without external drives, giving you the flexibility to add drives that suit your storage needs best before you can use the system. In both cases, the OS will deploy automatically and start booting from your hard drives. Your system will then continue to automatically install some necessary roles and features. The Configure Windows Server Essentials wizard will start up next to guide you through the steps to configure your Windows Storage Server 2012 R2 Essentials system. The first step in the wizard is where you enter your company's name. The wizard will automatically generate a domain name for your computer network based on your company name but you can also just type a custom name. Please note that you can use letters and numbers only. Commas, dashes, etc., or symbols do not work for domain names. Please notice that if you want to change your server's name, now is the time. Once you complete the configuration wizard, you cannot change the server name. In the next step, you specify a username and password for your new domain's administrator account. Moving forward, this is the user account you will use from now on to add or delete users, give or revoke permissions. Basically, any changes to your network or server. Click Configure to continue. Congratulations! You've just set up your very own domain. You can now close the configuration wizard. Now comes the interesting part. Making your server accessible from almost anywhere so you can drive your business when you are in the office or on the road. Let's go to the dashboard management interface your simplified one-stop shop for server management and configuration. On the Home tab under Getting Started, you can find a list of guided steps to get your server ready for business. Let us focus here on getting your server accessible from anywhere. If you already own a domain name for your business, you can use it here. But if you need one, help is on the way. You can purchase a professional domain name that also supports email through a provider in the wizard, bring your own, or you can get started with a free, Microsoft-hosted, personalized name that is simply appended to the remotewebaccess.com root domain name. This is what we are going to use here to enable Anywhere Access. You are going to need your Microsoft account to register the domain name. If you don't have one, you can sign up for one right there. Choose your desired domain name and check if it is still available, then set it on your server. Use your new domain name to enable remote access in a secure fashion from both your local network or even from wherever business takes you, as long as you have internet access. You can then extend this privilege to your other users or groups. Wrap it all up and done. Now that your server is all online, you have the option to not only back up your valuable business data locally, but also into the cloud with Microsoft's Azure Backup subscription. Even if there is a water or fire in your office, your business data is kept safe. Let us show you how. First, you get the online service part ready. You can opt to try it out first or subscribe right away. Then you download and install the Microsoft Azure Backup add-in. Once the add-in is installed, you register your server for Azure Backup. Select the folders you want backed up and win. Copy the backup passphrase file to a USB stick and keep it somewhere safe as this is the key to your online backup vault. Azure Cloud Backup and maybe sleeping a bit better at night. Done. Check. Now onto the force that powers your business. Let your productivity flow a bit more easy with the help of Microsoft's Office 365 and its smooth integration into your Windows Store Server 2012 R2 Essentials. The Office Integration Wizard allows you to find try out or purchase a subscription that fits your business needs. From very basic Office web apps to the Office 365 Business Premium subscription that includes full Office from Word, Excel, and PowerPoint to Outlook and OneNote as locally installed applications for each of your subscribed users, plus business class hosted exchange email, SharePoint for collaboration, and even link high def video conferencing and instant messaging. Set up your Office 365 account in a few easy steps. Select the number of user licenses you want to purchase. 
Opt for a Microsoft hosted email name if you do not have a professional domain name for email yet. And then continue with the integration wizard. Provide your newly set up Office 365 administrator username and password. Apply a strong password policy to help protect your information on your server and in the cloud. And roll out your changes. Restart your dashboard and you are ready for Office integration. Go unleash your team's productivity with Office 365. As long as you have enough user licenses, any user account you add can get his or her Office applications. And, depending on the subscription type, also a business class email account, SharePoint access, and hosted link video conferencing in IM. In the same wizard, you can also grant your new user access to shared folders on your server, from within your Office network, or from practically everywhere with an internet connection. In a last step, you then get links that allow your new users to connect their computer to the server, from in the office, or from wherever business takes them. Windows Storage Server, where business meets simplicity.